Oh, hello everybody! I am back <laughs> for a long, long overdue <laughs> uh, v VLTC or v v VCLT uh, thank you video. Uh, some, some love train coming on. Uh, I don't know how long ago, many videos ago it was, I had talked about how I didn't have Intermounting Flame from the Mahavishnu Orchestra. And uh, Bill, Mr. Bill Kamarata, or, or Ka Kama, how do you pronounce it? I had it right the first thing. <laughs> Kamarata, Kamarata. Sorry if I'm murdering that. Uh, uh, his, his name is uh, Divarada on YouTube. Uh, he had commented that he happened to have a spare, or, or rather he saw a copy for a buck in a store and he picked it up for me. And I was like, hey, you know, great, thanks. You know, I really appreciate that. Uh, and not only did he send me what you hear in the background, which is Intermounting Flame, which he was nice enough to put in a Blake sleeve, which is probably murdering the view of it. There you go. <laughs> but he also sent me three others. Uh, two that really blew me away, but we'll, we'll get there. Uh, if you don't know Mahavishnu Orchestra, I feel bad for you guys. <laughs> I really do. I mean, mm, what's there to say? Just, mm. I'm going to make this short. I'm not even going to talk that much about it, but you know, Bill, Thank you so much. This, this actually, uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Oh, I've been out all day and I, I just showered and I can't think because I'm tired. Uh, this completes <laughs> my uh, Mahavishnu Orchestra uh, collection. Uh, not my John McLaughlin, but my Mahavishnu Orchestra, so thank you very much. He also sent this, he put it in a cool <laughs> mobile fidelity you know, sleeve there, so very cool. The other one he sent me which is awesome because I love, I love Jeff Beck and I don't have this one, so the Jeff Beck group, totally just rock and killer record. And the last two, which were like, <laughs> which were like really cool because I, did, I don't, at, well I do now, but I didn't have anything from these guys. He sent me two residence LPs, uh, 13th anniversary show, and it's like, other than the cutout, I mean, it is just perfectly mint. Unbelievably mint. <laughs> yeah, what was this? Uh, uh, featuring Snake Finger. Uh, how do you describe the resonance? Just weird avant rock with a bit of a soundtrack sort of edge to it. I guess you could call them symphonic at times. I don't even know, so. Really, really enjoyed this one. And also, title in Limbo with The Residence and Ronaldo <laughs> and The Low. This one's just weird. <laughs> Let's just put it, this is just weird and trippy. And again, except for the cutout, I mean, just absolutely, even the vinyl is just perfectly, perfectly mint. I mean, look at that. Like it, 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 like it hasn't been played. Fucking gorgeous. Love it. So, I mean, to, to you know, for someone to send me two residents, it's like, whoo! I could, I, I popped the package over, I couldn't believe it. And, there's more. On top of the records and a very nice printed letter, he sent me this cheese sandwich by none other than Bill himself. Divarada, uh, and it is, it is, it is, it is, how do I describe it? It's, it's, you can't call it experimental music, but it's sort of odd music. It's a blend of, like, electronic with lots of synth and some rock guitar in there. Uh, it's, it's good. Like I, I really enjoy it. Um, at times, it gets like sometimes with like the the drum machine, <laughs> the drum program with the with the synthesizers. Sometimes it gets a little cheesy. 
uh, but overall really good and I really enjoy the songs uh, like the second song checking in where he's playing guitar I really dig your guitar playing I mean, I mean it is awesome awesome uh, just like a uh, potato preserves a 20 minute long song longest song on them uh, it's it had it, it starts off with this this synth thing and then the guitar comes in halfway through it and it's just totally awesome <laughs> you know uh, at times it seems a bit uh, playful uh, you know at, at times it, it's just sort of odd but I dig it I really really dig this and and he had it what, what's it say in here uh, ah, he says it himself. This is an instrumental album of sounds and noises recorded between 1975 and 1989, then assembled and edited in 2002. It is approximately 75 minutes long, and <laughs> it 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 has it has a great vintage sound with it from because they're older recordings, and definitely pretty damn cool to have this. He pressed these in. Uh, 2004. Uh, I will I will put a link down where he's offering these to anyone who wants them. All, all he asks is that you pay postage, three bucks for postage, and they're yours. And I suggest you get it, <laughs> just because it's cool, quirky music, and the names are hilarious because it's all revolving around food. <laughs> I mean, checking in a uh, spontaneous uh, whatnot excursion, uh, potato preserves. <laughs> cheaper cheese warmer cheese <laughs> F fish dinner rotunda <laughs> just the names alone crack me up it's, it's, it's damn good I wish I could think of more to say about it but I'm really bad when it comes to trying to dissect and talk about music so just suffice it to say I really enjoyed this. This was probably the coolest thing to get out of all of what you got me. So, I mean, Bill, thank you so much. I'm sorry this is so late. <laughs> and uh, although I, I have no idea what to get you in return, uh, rest assured one day I'll come across something that makes me think about you and you will be getting it. <laughs> so, uh, you know, until then, be good, everybody.